Welcome back, guys, to the adventures of Link So the Night Cat. We are on the quest, the break of dawn, at the at the uh, the beckon of Meridia, one of the Daedric demon lord ladies, whatever. And we're here um, to guide her light through the temple and restore it to its former glory. But more importantly, to get lots of cool treasure, and it's specifically one very shiny sword, desecrated corpse. Is that, um, Imperial Armor? That's what sort of what it looks like. But you've got gold, that's what I care about. So let's explore Kilkreath Temple. I'm going to just assume there's going to be monsters and traps and all the other things we normally find. And let's see, we're still trying to level archery, so... Ooh, desecrated corpse. More gold, yes! Gonna be uh, using the bow mostly, maybe my dagger sometimes for funsies. We've got a wooden door adept, which is is ain't no thing. Status? No. Okay, it's it's a little bit of a thing. No, almost there. There we go. Third try. Oh. -ho. What did you open? Something in one of these areas. Okay, so let's explore this guy. Yep, and we have a treasure chest and a and a crap sword. Oh, did I just did I just trip a uh, trap? Trip a trap? No, it looks not that. It looked like a log trap or something, but it, I think that's actually a beam for the ceiling. Okay, to continue. No signs of life or unlife yet. I assume we're going to be getting to that quickly, though. Some candles. Are these candles lit? Who's been here to keep these candles lit? Or are they magical or always lit candles? And here is Meridia's light. I wonder if this is going to be a puzzle to bounce the light around. Do we have to get it to connect to that guy? Probably. But first, treasure. Yeah, I'm not seeing any monsters, so let's just run. Speed thing. Oh, oh, that was me just kicking a rib cage around. All these corpses have money on them. And looks like is this door going to be barred? Requires key. Cannot to be picked. Okay. So let's see uh, what this thing does. I bet we can spin it. Look at this. Looks like something goes there. In there. Okay. Activate the pedestal. Oh, that was simple. I thought it would be a little more... Uh, a little more involved in that. Like I have to spin it and point it different directions and stuff. Oh, and I guess that was the key. Okay. Well, that puzzle sucked. Maybe that's just just to uh, introduce you to the concept, and that maybe it'll get a little more complex. I'm just gonna assume these guys are not friendly. So, hey, oh, corrupted shade. Yep, not gonna be friendly. Yeah, come, come get me. What do you want? Oh, one more. Oh, I wonder if I should. Uh, let's try this guy for these guys, just for fun. Use my elven arrows. Or my, the, uh, the summon arrows. Smackers! Smacker! Yeah, never mind. Never mind. Not any better. In fact, it seems worse. And there you go. Kind of a cool effect. I guess maybe against vampires, but uh, my normal bow and arrows are so good that I don't think there's a reason to carry that thing around. It's just gonna go, it's gonna be one of my trophy weapons in my trophy room. Okay, give me my arrows back. Okay, so we have another room. Another beacon. A door. And I hope it's more involved than just clicking on it. I hope we have to spin it around and get several ones to line up or something like that. That would be... That would be more interesting than just clicking on it. Let's see. Let's see what happens. Click. No, we're just gonna 
We're just gonna click on it, and that's gonna open the door. Oh, and it opened this door too. It opened more than one. Okay, Shady. Oh, three times. Sneak of damage. Oh, oh, oh. You like to play, huh? Not very good, are you? My arrow back. Okay, let's investigate this room. These urns always have something or other. Usually a little bit of gold. Hey, nothing right there. Looks like there are... Oh, look at this. Yeah, okay. Maybe we'll get a little bit more involved. I hope so. Otherwise, it'd be kind of a wasted opportunity. If it doesn't. Book tattered. No thanks. Okay, we got anything else in here? Just a, We have a lot of views to the, the side here, but... Can we get in this door? Yes. Alright, let's see what's down here. Another... Oh, treasure room. We've got this black smoke hanging in the air, which makes me think there's a, a ghost or something there, but... Nothing's jumped out and bit me yet. Oh, I'd kick something. More gold. Okay, let's just keep going. Oh! Hey, buddy! Oh, you saw me, did ya? No sneak attack. Hero! Oh, got you! I got you! Okay, uh, I don't see anybody else in here. So let's run through. Let's go upstairs. Oh, somebody saw me. Great! Use your boost! Yeah, use that. Look at this cool helmet. These guys are kind of stylish. Okay, stop it! Stop it! Stop it! I said stop it! That's what I get for not sneaking for once. Oh! Okay, more doors. And then we have this guy. And activate! So I'm gonna do open that door, and that's the next place we need to go. But we skipped some stuff before in the previous room with an activation thingy. Store stamina five, and an arcane enchanter, and a door with a treasure chest behind it. So I'm looking for a chain or a button. I'll see one. I may have to get that somewhere else. Ooh, iron door master. That means treasure. And that means broken lockpicks. Two lockpicks. See how many lockpicks it takes me to get through this master door. Let's see. Three. Let's see how many it takes just to find the the weak spot here. Oh. Okay. Three to get to the weak spot. Four. Total now. Four total. Four total. No. 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 Oh. Okay. Five. Five broken lockpicks. Ah. 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 Six. Six broken lockpicks! Ah, ah, ah! Shout out to Sesame St Oh, look at that. I wonder what that's gonna open. That's gonna open this. And give me that chest. That is some crappy loot for a master... A master lock. Okay, so we need to go... That way, through that door. So let's backtrack because I missed a room. Okay, rocks, rocks. Just jump over them. So let's see if we head back this away. Back through here, and then this room up here. There should be another door we can go through. Yeah, this is the last chamber. This should right up here. Yeah, we never went that way. Did I search? I did not search the urn. Whopping seven gold in that one. Okay. Oh. I see. <laughs> it's 
So you couldn't actually go this way. So the dungeon is in fact being linear. What I wouldn't give for some more complex dungeons. Okay, so I guess we're going to go back this way. And then go through that other door we opened. And I guess all the all that stuff we saw through the gaps in that corridor. All the these beacons pointing at things. I guess that was just eye candy. Doesn't really seem to have any functional gameplay mechanic. Gold! That's empty. Coming back here, some gold. Alright, here we go. Onward! Desecrated corpse. Kilcreeth balcony! Okay, doke. Oh, look at this. It's lighting the beacons. Look at that, and a treasure chest, yay. Ooh, an expert treasure chest. There it is. Okay, one to find the weak spot. Much easier than the master one. That's really just a little bit of random luck more than anything. Ah, okay, T two, two, two lock picks. Ah, ah, ah. No, no. Oh, gosh. There we go. Only two lock picks, that's pretty good. Ooh, that's more like it. 300 gold, raised dead. Carrying capacity. I may need to disenchant that, so I'm gonna pick those up. I may not have that available. It might be uh, nice to make a full set of carrying capacity stuff. I guess we're heading in here into the ruins. Okay, okay. More urns, more stuff. Probably more dead dudes. So we have this thing. Oh, let's uh, take care of these guys first. Hey, boy. Oh, shuck it. Oh, you want to investigate your friend, huh? How sad. Shuck it. Okay, and there's one more. He might be up on that catwalk. I don't see him. Let's check upstairs. Well, I become sneaky and fade from view. Ooh, treasure! Restore magic and resist magic. Okay, and then we've got a door there. Requires key. It's probably going to be opened by that. Or one of the others. Oh, he is up there. And I bet we need... I bet that links around with there. Okay. Is that going to open this door? Yes, it did. Okay, uh, but first... Let's come over here and loot these two guys. Hopefully get my... No, no arrow. And then check on this stuff. What's this? Requires key. Okay. That may be the last place we go, maybe. Just another urn. Yeah, the urns only ever have a, just a little bit of gold at a time. Oh, here's a guy. He did. You know he did. And he's guarding some treasure. Had to kill him. He ate my arrow, though. What is this? Gold? 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 Glazed Nordic plate? What's that on it? A gold emerald ring! Yes! That's what I'm talking about. Jewelry! Expensive and lightweight. And what? What is this? Okay. Um. So let's head back over here, and I'm gonna stay sneaky. Jump and jump. Oh, not quite. Uh, because there's a dude up there. He'll be able to see me, and will come after me and do bad things. Here, here's somebody. May not be the same guy. Oh, oh, I am so overpowered right now. Wait till I get a dragon bow, a dragon bone bow. It's going to be crazy, and all I need to do that is one level. And we're very close to a level up, so I can put that last uh, perk point in, into smithing. 
and then we'll have smithing at 100 and or not uh, enchanting at 100 smithing at 100 and enchanting at 100 okay let's unlock the trap Oh, okay. Well, there's the there's the wiki wiki. Hey, yeah. There we go. Looks like the trap killed this guy. I guess these are the spike holes. I guess that's what the trap was. A bunch of spikes come out of the ground. An empty strong box. Somebody's been here already. And a, a mere 19 gold. Fortify archery. I actually will probably never use that, but I picked it up anyway. Okay, this room sucks. Totally, totally let down and disappointed with this room. Uh, let's see, anything up here? A little bit more gold. And a common garnet for my gem jar, yay! Oh! What'd it do? I don't know what it did. It did something. Okay, and we have another one of these. What did you do? Maybe disarm that trap? Or open something this way? And over here is a fire. Make me feel nice and toasty. There was a guy on this catwalk. It might be that guy we killed in that room back there. Nope, here, here's somebody. Let's go this way. Let's flank him. F flank him! Oh, they can't handle it. Can't handle the scrambled eggs. Is it? Wait, no. Eggs Benedict. They can't handle the eggs Benedict. It looks like there's been some corpse manipulation here. Yeah? Uh, Battle of Red Mountain. Hey, block increased. New book. Restore health. Lovely. Dumb helmet. Embalming thingy. Oh, oh, no. Okay, come on. There we go. Okay, more crap. More junk. And do we need to get to that to activate? I think we do. That requires a key. I bet that's what we need to do. Okay, so everything's dead in here. Weapon away! And you can make that with a normal jump, but I'm gonna jumpy jump. Activate. Go up there. Unlock. Back here. Probably make that jump too. Alright, here we go. Next chamber. In the Dawn Guard Sanctuary. Or not the Dawn Guard, the Break of Dawn. He did. You know he did. Somebody else is here. Here he comes. Oh! What's that sound? What's that sound? Oh! <laughs> That's the sound of you getting shot in the back, chum. More gold. Hmm. So I have to say, these uh, these ghosts aren't really presenting much of a challenge. This uh, whole quest may be geared more towards lower levels. I'm sort of just strolling right through. Imperial bow, whoop de doops. And was there a thing for us to manipulate? Let's see, there's a path going that way. Let's look up here for some more goodies. Oh! I had a I had a feeling. I had a sixth sense, tell me. Be careful. That looks suspicious. Okay, so now we can head in here, knocking these rooms down one, two, three. Nothing. Let's resume the snake at the corner. What do we have here? More, more crap, more ruined junk. And here's another one of these things. Ooh. Okay, what's this going to connect to? Ow! Ooh! Ooh, that's a laser! Don't get in the laser! It hurts! Ah! Ooh! Let's do it again. Ah! <laughs> but it opened that door right there. So let's take the shortcut down. That was easy. 
That was easy. Not much of a puzzle. Alright, now we're down to the catacombs. And I don't see more of the light stuff. Maybe we're done with that? Maybe not. Oh, no, we're not. There's another one. Any more ghosties? Hello, ghosties! Okay, I don't see any. Like that. And let's see, let's search for some... Frost suspicion. Um, I probably have that, but I'll take it anyway. Just in case to add to my collection of enchants. Okay, activate you. What are you gonna do? You're gonna go over there. Open this. Yes, yes. Okay, here we go. Gotta be some bad, bad guys in. Oh, here. Yes, this is more like it. Destroy Malcolm. This is what I'm talking about. I wonder if I can. I wonder if I can do this in here. No, I can't. I can't summon Dernavir inside. Wait, can I? I don't know. <laughs> I don't think so. I tried. I tried. I don't think he want to come inside. Even though I'm summoning him from another realm, so you wouldn't think he's like he's not like flying in from Pennsylvania or something. He's just coming in from a. He's teleporting. He's being transposed. Transpositionally positional these. Oh. Whatever, these guys are sissies. Okay, they're all dead. Okay, uh search remains. Search remains. Oh. And he sees me. Okay. Ow. Oh! 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 Close one! Okay, quick save in case things go bad and Oh! Lost me. Oh my gosh! Okay, I'm gonna sit here for a second. I wonder, does this hurt me just stepping on that? It looks like it, like it's... Or is that the after effects of the spell? Let's find out right now. Okay. No, that's just the after effects. Oh, I got you. Oh, his shade! He was easy to kill, but his shade is easy to kill as well. Oh. <laughs> okay. You, you seemed really dangerous for a second. Hey, Whoa! The defiler is defeated. God, you surprised me. Take Dawnbreaker from its pedestal. I will. Give me a second. I'm stealing other stuff before I steal that. I guess everything's dead, so I don't need a snake. What do we got here? More gold. An urn. Oh, the empty urn. An urn and a fern. Oh, how I yearn for the urn and the fern. That's a great corpses everywhere. Yay! Desecrated corpses! These desecrated corpses are filthy, stinking rich. Well, not not really, but in terms of the average amount of gold that corpses tend to have, that's pretty darn good. Pretty, pretty, pretty good. And let's search Malcrim himself. Is that really the best thing you have? Soul Jam 5, I guess, is okay. I expected you to have something better. Maybe your shade? Some gold. I'm so disappointed. I expected more out of you. Okay, I already searched you. Okay, so that, that looks like all of them. Let's see what we get. Are we gonna get lasered? Laser beamed? Ow! Ow! Let's see if my body flinches. Ooh, look, I'm, on, I'm electricized. Ow! <laughs> okay, let's just do it. Oh, completed retreat bumper. Oh no! What's going on? Ah, it's bright! Oh, here we go. Oh, we're up here again. Sweet. Is she gonna drop me? Malkarin is vanquished. Skyrim's dead shall remain at rest. This is as it should be. This is because of you. A new day is dawning, and you shall be its herald. Yeah, alright. 
Take the mighty Dawnbreaker, and with it purge corruption from the dark corners of the world. Wield it in my name, that my influence may grow. Okay. I wield this mighty blade. I'll keep the sword, but screw your religion. The plant cares nothing for the rays that bring it the warmth of the sun. As you carry Dawnbreaker, so will my light touch the world. Yeah, whatever. Oh, here we go. Ah. Oh, I think we're all right. Yes, we are. We're okay. And I should have that in my inventory now, yeah? So let's check. Dawnbreaker. 24 measly damage, but I haven't improved it yet either. Burns for 10 points, and when killing undead, a chance to cause a fire explosion that turns or destroys near, nearby undead. Oh, that'll, that'll be good in dungeons. Have a lot of uh, undead there. Look at that, it's shiny. Oh, ow! Okay, too enthusiastic. I like it, it has a good balance and weight to it. Nice and sharp. All right, so um, there we go, there is the Break of Dawn. We've done Meridia's Daedra quest. So I think next time, uh, I'm gonna do some stuff to fit to level to 52 off screen. And then um, I already have two points saved up. So actually I'll have three points, so I'll have an extra one. But we'll be able to do, when did it smithing get to 100? It was 99 last time I checked. Uh, we'll be able to finish off enchanting and smithing and craft some dragon bone weapons and armor. So a new set of weapons and armor. I haven't had a new uh, set of armor in a while since I crafted the the, uh, the glass stuff. And then we'll get this guy extra effect. Two enchantments on each item, which is gonna be baller. All right, so we're doing that next. And then I think after that, we may return and finish off the main storyline, finally. Hope you enjoyed the video. See you later. Take it easy. Have a good day. Bye-bye.